Planet of the Fakes for Women and Pig Star HH News. Disclaimer for awareness and educational purposes only. Florida woman randomly lunges, stabs cop in arm before she's shot dead. A police officer has been cleared following a fatal shooting initiated after a Florida woman stabbed a Jacksonville cop in the arm with a knife. AB 13 reports that the state attorney for the 4th Judicial Court in Northeast Florida ruled the death of 29-year-old Leah Baker a justifiable police shooting. The incident occurred on April 11 in Jacksonville, when officers responded to a call about a roommate disturbance. According to the police report, when the officers arrived, Baker emerged from the home with the knife and stabbed Jacksonville, Officer Elizabeth Meckling in the arm. I've just been f she stabbed the officer said on her radio. Meckling ordered Baker to drop the knife and get on the ground, while another officer, SGT John Nobles, arrived for backup. Baker, who threw the knife down, walked toward it again, while Meckling warned her to not pick it up. When Baker reaches for the knife, Meckling fired shots, but visibly shaken, she missed. Baker then grabbed the knife and ran toward Nobles, who shot her four times. Shots fired. Meckling yelled into her radio. News 4 Jax reports that as Baker fell to the ground she held onto the knife. As officers and a police dog approached her, Baker began punching the dog. The dog grabbed a hold of her leg, and dragged her toward the street where officers handcuffed her and sent her away, with paramedics who arrived at the scene, Baker died at the hospital. That happened so fast that had he not stopped the threat, he could have been stabbed as well. So, he did the right thing safety expert Ken Jefferson told News 4 Jax, referring to SGT Nobles. Baker's mother, Charity Baker, told the outlet that her daughter suffered from mental illnesses and couldn't get the help she needed. I can't condone my daughter's actions, but at the same time, I have fought with different hospitals to get the help she needed. I had her in what I thought was a safe house Charity Baker previously said. She did suffer from mental illness. I never thought the police would kill my daughter. The mother added that it was Leah Baker herself who initially called 911 for assistance with a roommate argument. Thank you very 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 much. Go to www. Ammer. Dash. Eka. Dot.